So sleep, let's talk about sleep for a second. How do I know if I'm getting enough sleep? How do I take care of my health is the overall question without health insurance. And that's what we talk about on my channel. We're not given health insurance by the government. We gotta take care of ourselves using the best resources we have. If you have insurance, you can go to a doctor, a neurologist and get a sleep study. But if you don't and you wanna know how you're sleeping, I can give you a couple tips on how to use your Apple Watch and your phone to track your sleeping. So let's talk about the types of sleep that there are. There are several cycles of sleep and how much you need of each cycle varies on your age. I use my sleep as an example based on a year's worth of data collected by my Apple Watch and paired with my phone. Let's talk about the four major areas of sleep. You have a period of awake time, you have a period of REM sleep, you have a period of core or light sleep, and then you have a period of deep sleep. Scientific sources break those down into subcategories, but for today, we're gonna have four categories. The time you're awake, the time that you're in REM sleep, the time that you're in core sleep, and the time that you are in deep sleep. If you look at my graph that I generated based on my sleep patterns, I'm in bed for about 10 hours on average, and I sleep for about seven hours in, I don't know, 10 to 20 minutes. If you break my sleep down, there may be areas that could be better. The average that I spend awake is about 6% of that time. So about 29 minutes, I'm in REM sleep for about an hour and four minutes or 14% of that time. I have about five hours and 42 minutes of core or light sleep, and that's 74%. And 6% or 30 minutes is deep sleep. One source that I read said that you need to sleep the deepest sleep 105 to 120 minutes a night. That's a lot more than I'm getting. Clevelandclinic.org says that I need to get about 20 to 40 minutes of deep sleep. So who knows? The jury is out on this data a little bit. I think they're still studying this stuff closely. But to get to your sleep information in your phone, you need to go to the health app. You scroll down until you get to sleep. When you get to sleep, you're gonna scroll down and they have a graph and you'll see it's really colorful. They've broken each night of sleep down into each of these categories. Where are you on this chart? How much awake time? How much REM sleep? How much core sleep? And how much deep sleep are you getting at night? Remember, go into your health app. Uh, it's a little heart in a white box. You're in your sleep, you're gonna scroll down and you're gonna look at those graphs and see how it's broken down by period. We know we're supposed to get between six and eight hours of sleep a night. Now, how that sleep is divided is also important. I do not get very restful sleep. So you notice I have to spend more time in bed than the average person in order to get my full night of sleep. Again, how do you compare with those numbers? A uh, shout out to the, the sources that I use today, healthline.com, Dr. Villalobos, clevelandclinic.org. Also a great resource on this. How much sleep are you getting? We know sleep is very important to our overall health. How do we navigate our health without health insurance? Because if you don't have health insurance to get this information, it's, it's difficult. With health insurance, you can go to a neurologist and have a sleep study done. Now, sleep study is only one night, so their sample group is one. So I actually think in this particular case, it's possible that the iPhone and Apple Watch may be giving you better data about your sleep than a sleep study. But I'm not a doctor, so I'm not telling you to depend solely on a device or two devices that are paired. If you have sleep issues that are serious, possibly sleep apnea, your respiratory rate goes down while you're sleeping, critically low, you do need to see a neurologist and get a sleep study done, regardless of whether you have insurance or no insurance.